The kickers got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. He makes his way out to about the 35. There's nothing more effective that a team can do offensively than to pound the ball right at the defense, trying to wear them down. First and 10, ball on the 35. Makes the catch and look out. Tackle made at the 45 yard line. That brings up second and nine. just never had a chance to get any running room. The defense was on him almost as soon as the ball was snapped. From their own 40-yard line, it's third down. Mike one, Mike one. Here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Blue four. Pitch. He's out of bounds at the 43-yard line. That'll make it fourth and two. They look like they've got the block on, and this offensive line's got to give him some time. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Golden Bears have shown over the course of the season that they want to get this guy the football, but you can't just go to him every play. But well, on the road, you especially want to take the crowd out of the game, and the one guy you know who can do it is this wide receiver. The problem you have is this defense, more often than not, is going to be a line to take him out of the game. And that, to your point, Brad, that's where somebody's going to have to step up, whether it's the running game, some of the other receivers, you're going to have to take some of the pressure off of him and really make it a team effort to be able to win this game on the road. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. They come out on an empty backfield. Caught, open field. He's to the 40. They'll bring him down at about the 45. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. From their own 45-yard line, first down. Ready! Makes the catch, and he's got nowhere to go. That makes it second and ten. Second and 10. Ball on the 45 yard line. Hey, watch the left, watch the left. Here we go. Easy, easy, easy. Big dog. And they get the sack. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Slings it. That was a good pass and catch there, but still not enough for the first down. That's not an easy conversion here on third down the offense. All the defense has to do is stay back, keep everything in front of them, come up and make a tackle. He really got a hold of that one. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Now he's scrambling. Brought down at the 25-yard line. That brings him second down. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. Complete brought down, nothing to do. That makes 
makes it third and three. The offense was pretty successful on that play there. That was a very good passing play to get the ball downfield for a very nice gain and a first down. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. yard line that pass play went for nearly enough to keep moving but they're stopped just short boy that's tough that is always a tough pill to swallow having to leave the field knowing how close you came to converting on third down you gotta get those he gets out to about the 15 yard line what is going on with his defense i mean don't get me wrong the offense is doing a nice job with first downs and they're executing well but the defense is just letting them maintain possession and move the ball right down the field They've got to try to change things up with their scheme. Be more aggressive. Attack. Do some things to change it up. Take some risks. Gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on the 13. Tackled for a loss. We played one quarter. This one's scoreless. That brings us third and twelve. We're all tied up as we head into quarter number two. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He's got it with room to run. He's pushed out of bounds. The seven-yard line. So it's fourth down. This should be an easy field goal. Connecticut could take the lead with this field goal. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. And you got to think they're pretty happy with holding them to a field goal right there. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Here's the screen to the wide out. Loose football. That was a close one, but the ball goes out of bounds. From their own 29-yard line. Second down. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That'll make it third and one. Mike 
Got some open field. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. From the 46-yard line, it's first down. There's a strike complete. He's down. Number 16 makes the tackle at the 41-yard line. That brings him second and five. Mike, check, 33. 33. Got it. And he goes down quickly. Number 33 on the tackle at the 37-yard line. Third down. down. And so it's another third down upcoming here. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. That's good for a gain of three yards. First down. Four down, four down. Mark check, 33. Let's go. Ready, run. Fires out to his receiver. Tackle at the 15. Number 33 brings him down. That makes it first and 10. This is the eighth play of this drive. Check three, check three, check three. Got to do better. Come on, QB, come on. Nice run up the middle. Call it a game of seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He's tackled at the seven. Here's play number 10 on the drive. They'll spread the field with five wide. He's on the run. Decides to take it himself, and he's got it. Touchdown. the uprights with the extra point. A 10-play, 76-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. So the score now, 7-3. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Gets out to around the 45. Six-yard setback. Well, that play was sort of out of sync from the start, but you have to also recognize that the defense made a great play. They read it from the get-go. Gets it off as he's hit. Complete. And he's tackled at the 47. Number 21 brings his down with the 47-yard line. That, that makes it 37. 37.
Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 45. Four down, four down. Mike one, Mike one. Dog <laughs> He gets rid of this one. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. It's away, and it's a booming punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. The Golden Bears offensive staff, I think, has done a good job of keeping their wide receiver in the game. Even though he's not having great stats, he's part of it, and the rest of the team now is picking up his slack, I think. Uh, this offense is still putting points on the board, and I think at times they're actually using the wide receiver, the go-to man who's drawing so much attention, really as a decoy, open up other avenues of this offense. I've seen other receivers make some plays. They're running the football. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of adjustments this defense makes to try to slow down these other members of this offense. And who knows, maybe that could open it back up for that marquee receiver. Out of bounds around the 16-yard line. Gain of three yards. That brings up third and 14. From their own 16-yard line. Third down. California is up by four. He's into the open field. They got to him, and he did not get the first down. Well, the defense was set up here to defend the pass and left some running room. He only fell a little bit short. It looks like they're going to go after this punt. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. You know, we're getting so used to pinball football with a lot of points. Kind of fun to see defenses play this way. Kind of refreshing, isn't it? I mean, every single week we call games, and you're seeing scores in the 30s and 40s. This is one of those low-scoring games. Which offense will get that big break? Eventually, it could be the team that wins it. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Fires quickly with a tight end. And he's taken down around the 48-yard line. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideouts. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Makes the grab and steps out right away. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. He heaves it to the end zone. It's knocked away, incomplete. I think if he'd reached out a second later, the receiver would have caught the ball. That's perfect timing by the safety. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get enough pressure on the quarterbacks. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. Balls it in as he's pushed out of bounds. and goal from the five and looking to cap this off with a touchdown. Tackle made at the three-yard line. The Huskies using their third and final timeout. Here's the eighth play of the series. It's up and he got it. We head into halftime with both offenses struggling. California's up by one. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. 
Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They're ready to begin another drive. California with a one-point lead. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's good to the five yards. That brings him second and five. From their own 30-yard line, it's second down. Halfback's got him in the quick throw. And they push him out right around the 30. Try and scramble. He's taken down at the 33. And this one is a beauty. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a t shirt that says finish. Finish. Whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. They gotta execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. They'll bring him down around the 36-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. They go with a run. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. No game. Third down. Double tight. That's going to bring up fourth down. Yeah, they just couldn't connect on a pass there. That was a very good stand by this defense. The punting team's got to give their kickers some time. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. The Huskies have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team's put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. Well, you know the offense would like to generate more than they did on their last possession. In the shotgun and five wideouts. He gets hit out of bounds around the 43-yard line. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. California is up one. Gets it. He's in space. He steps out at the 47-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Fires out to his wide out. Brought down right around the 40. Number three on the tackle at the 40-yard line. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. I got eight. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Gives it off. He tackles him for a loss. The defensive end was the victor on that play as he bolted in to tackle him for a loss. And he's able to do that because the interior linemen held their ground, leaving the runner with no options. And he's got his man, and he's tackled right away. Game 15 on the play. First down. Here we go. Oh! From the 27-yard line, 
First down. Five wide. Inside the 10. Fires it out. A huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. At the four yard line. That makes it first and goal. California up a point. Let's go. Tackle just outside the goal line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Tailback goes nowhere on the option. This is where the defense makes a name for themselves. It's third down and goal from the one. It's power against power right now on the field. Both teams have their jumbo sets out there. Fires quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. as well. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine-play, 66-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of center. And they can forget about returning this one. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And they get nice yardage on that run. Second and five. Ball on their own 30. by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. Get to that quickly. And he tackles him hard at the 43 yard line. That makes it second and two. That's it for quarter number three. Folks, we got a great game on our hands. 14-6, California. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Here we go, oh, here we go, oh. One's the mic, watch one. Red two, green nine, green nine. He stopped behind the line. I like the combination of speed and strength that this cornerback plays with. He's a real valuable part of the defense. Third and five situation. Ball on the 46. Green nine, green nine. Makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go. Big stop 
offensively. Yeah, they only needed a few yards here to keep the drive alive. Great job by the defense to shut them down. Really a great stop by the defense. This will go down as one of those critical plays. California is up by eight. That's a great tackle at the 49. The slam pattern, good for about eight yards on the play. At the 49-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. They'll drop in for a loss. Nothing doing that time. Defender stayed home, blocking wasn't there, and down he went. Yard line. I think he just barely got it. That's a great job by both the quarterback and receiver to keep this drive alive. First and ten, ball on the 48. Throws it deep. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. That makes it first and goal. Second and goal, five yards to the goal line. They'll line up with five wide receivers. He's scrambling, and he can't get away from the pressure. That makes a third and goal. The defense has really held their own the last two plays. Now it's third and goal from the seven. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And he's tackled after positive yardage. He gets four, maybe five yards on the counter. Connecticut will take their first time out of the half. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. I have a feeling we haven't seen the end of the fireworks today. Brad, you and I have seen some crazy things happen over the years. Anything can still happen. They've got to get a touchdown on this drive, and if they can, hold on, look out. Maybe they got a shot to come back and get into the game. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. That'll bring up second and 12. And got him! And they make the stop at the 28. Great play for the offense, a great call by the offense. But the defense has to change things up. They've got to put more pressure on this quarterback. First down, he's knocked down. From the 16-yard line, first down.
Quick throw in the end zone, touchdown. Late in the fourth quarter, one possession game, and this is where poise really takes over. Whoever shows it will win the football game. And they're looking to get two points here. A little over a minute in the game. Here we go, here we go, here we go. X7! Hey, if you kill it, motion me out. They don't get it! A five-play, 76-yard drive, and they'll come away with six points after failing on the two-point conversion. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. And he's taken down at the 44-yard line. This is where the offense has to come to the forefront. They work all week for situations like this. They've got the lead, they've got a chance to add to it, and that'd mean a victory. He's taken down around the 41-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. With the defensive line neutralizing the blocks, these linebackers are able to come up and make plays in the holes. They'll work the left. Thus, he's using their third and last timeout. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. He gets it up, and he nails the long field goal. I wouldn't be surprised if they just squib it here. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. A touchdown was the end result of their last drive as this offense moved the ball very well with their passing game. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. Right now with this offense, they are in sync and really the timing and execution is flawless. And he hits him hard at the 34. That'll make it second and long. Red two. And he stops the clock with a spike. That'll bring up third and long. Behind on the scoreboard here in the fourth quarter, and third and very, very long. So they'll have one last shot here to possibly tie this game up. They'll need their prayers to be answered if they don't want to lose this one. And he's level at the 25 yard line. Golden Bears, coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. So that wraps things up for us. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.